Perhaps the biggest and happiest story most likely to put a smile on your face, the Cubs winning the World Series. The hugs and jumping for joy images Chicago will never forget. Before we ring in the new year, we felt there were some other stories worth a second look. Some of the happy endings in 2016 involving just regular people from our area. CBS 2's Roseanne Tejas pulled the newsroom for the stories that made us smile. We hope they do the same for you. <laughs> 2016 brought plenty of heartwarming medical miracles like baby Ava back at home. It still doesn't seem real. With a brand new heart after 111 days in the hospital, a tiny baby in dire need of a transplant found a liver donor in just 40 minutes. It's like high fives. I mean, it was it was crazy. And conjoined twins who underwent a 27 hour surgery were successfully separated, yet remain inseparable. From miracles to missions, some Chicago doctors showed us medical equipment donated and delivered to Syria to help the bombing victims. As long as I am able to provide. And from serious to silly. Hello, I'm your teacher. My name's Mr. Reed, and it's very nice to meet you. This Chicago teacher made us smile with his rapping welcome to his fourth grade class. Awesome dog. An awesome dog had us ooing and awing as he walks himself on Chicago's Riverwalk. Or he spreads the love. We saw the kindness of strangers, like the two guys who spotted this popsicle vendor in Little Village. The original idea was to try to give him a day off. But a GoFundMe page raised more than $384,000 and a smile worth even more. How about these smiles? A young shooting victim swimming in a pool donated by a police officer to help wash away the memory. That is wonderful what they did for my daughter. Some nice gestures were completely unexpected. Maybe we should give back. Like donations raised for the family of a pregnant woman killed by gunfire. I want to inmate. Inmates moved by the thought of a baby in need with no mom. And a story that proved people care. A nine-year-old stood up by all 12 RSVPs at his birthday party. It's heartbreaking. Until the story spread, bringing birthday cards and gifts from around the world. So many. Gerald shared them with other kids who called it a miracle. Enjoy your gifts. Thank you. People came through. There were many, many more stories of generosity and kindness. These are just a few. We hope to bring you many more in 2017. And Happy New Year to you just a little early, Erica. Oh, thank you. What a treat to see that story. You know, with our challenges, it's great to see the positive highlights. Yes, it is.